Hi YouTube, welcome on back. Episode 3, Darkest Dungeon Black Reliquary. Going on back into the catacombs here with the mixed level squad. Trying to get folks prepped up for our first boss run eventually. You have returned. Nicholas. Hi YouTube. Appreciate the seven months. Let's do it. I think we're ready. I think we got it. Trinkets are all set up. Squad's ready. Going for the Arbalist's Sturdy Grease, which don't really matter, honestly. I haven't been paying a ton of attention to the rewards, which is, you know, typically the case. Something unique to this one, though, of course, as mentioned just now, we gotta bring a bunch of torches to try to take advantage of this illumination skill. We get a lot of damage from that. I guess I could have gone for the camping skills on these guys, too, but I don't think it's really that big of a concern yet. I wish I didn't have to bring the anti-venom. I wish I had the option of leaving it behind, but since I'm gonna bring it, I might as well bring a full stack. Although I guess that is kind of just a waste of money. I've been trying to... trying to be a little bit more conservative, I suppose, with my cash. But I'll bring, like, a couple of each of these, I guess. The cleansing salts I've almost never used, so I don't know. Probably not gonna get a lot of value out of those. I'm pretty okay with bringing two full stacks of food, especially because that's really cheap. I'm liking bringing the archaeology kits. I'm gonna bring at least three of those. Uh, two keys, just in case we get a secret room again this time. I've learned my lesson about that. And I probably shouldn't worry about bringing bandages. I've got battlefield medicine if I absolutely need it, which actually, I think I'm gonna go ahead and swap this for that. I think blinding gas, I'm using quite a bit less these days, so. Okay. Cool. That'll do. Let's hit it. Am I missing anything, right? I think we're good. I'm missing a quick sip of my cold brew. That's what I'm missing. Mm. Mm. There's that energy. There's the flavor. Slav burglar. These ruins Even were 26 months. With the Kovarot people. Let us see what they have left behind. Okay. I gotta say, feels like for the most part in this mod, there are very few poor uh, layouts. Of the maps. Nah, that's not that great. Like usually the layouts are. Uh, Stone, I didn't bring foliage, shovels. I knew I forgot something, man. Son of a bitch. That was fast. The immediate punishment. The darkness will not impede us. We are the flame. All right. Well, hopefully I find one. And, um, and or I can scout out the rest of the dungeon and maybe avoid shovel paths for the whole thing, but probably not. I'm gonna go ahead and put those odds at slim. Alright, gotta make sure I don't miss any curios or interactions in the background here either. I've been prone to do that. Dope Stone Lion. 30 months on the pile, welcome on back in, appreciate you. Yeah, we'll do the cleansing salt here, sounds good. Should reduce some stress, nice. Effect there. Thank you for the bear hugs. I always appreciate that. Thank you for the support, y'all. Very kind. I haven't tried a ton of stuff on here. Nice. Okay, cool. We'll probably just dump that. Not the greatest thing. There go all the are the archaeology kids though. But requires funds. Oh, we haven't gotten a single jester yet. That's who we're missing. That's who hasn't shown up to the party yet. Maybe we'll find him on the next ferry. No combat yet here either. Which I'm pretty happy about. Hey, pl Crazy Blaze, hope you're doing well. Uh, no more archaeology kits. Ooh, bully. Yikes. Alright. I think I can cleansing salt that, right? Yeah, cool. Dope. Um, eh, try that. Whoa, nice! That makes sense! 
perfectly logical. Cool. Uh, no more cleansing salts here, though. Uh-oh. Oh, shit. Bomber. Oh, well. Good lord, we've just been getting... Curio after Curio with no combat, which is more than okay with me. Dude, he's got... Look at this. Plus 60% damage to his melee for four fights. That's ridiculous. He's gonna be... He's gonna be even... More... What's the word I'm looking for? His, his obliterations shall obliterate more obliteratory. That's, I believe that's exactly what I wanted to say. Even more damage, Lear, than before. Hmm. Well, crazy Blaze. Thank you very much for the gifted sub to Feral Flygon. Welcome onto the pile. Appreciate it. Truly do appreciate all the gifted support and subscriptions lately, y'all. Subs are the backbone of my Twitch income. Gifted subs are a big, big part of that, too, so thank you very, very much. I subbed earlier today. Say my name, Death. You just wanted me to, to welcome Death. Uh. Get him. And that looks pretty good. Is your dog bark? There we go. One down. I was gonna say dodge, I didn't want to jinx it though, so I'm glad I didn't. Okay, so illumination is still a great option. Gonna get us some more torchlight. A little extra damage. That was the whole point of going out into the, uh... Going out with so many torches, so we might as well start trying to take advantage of it. Play grenade. Leper's probably gonna go last, unfortunately. Oh, never mind. Casual 33 to 67 damage here. <laughs> An apt description, narrator. I think that's a new high. That might be a new PB for leopard damage. 101 in a single hit. That's pretty remarkable. Goodbye. It's leper 101, right? Yeah. Exactly. Hey, nice. That's a lot more than I expected. All right, goodbye. Come on now. Oh my god, what is this? Is that our... Oh, that's the same one that has imposter syndrome, right? I think I just haven't fixed that yet. Yeah, I think we already ran into that before. Okay. How the hell have we already used eight torches? I guess we have been going through the entire dungeon more or less unimpeded up to that point, so... That kind of makes sense. All right, so this was the sharpened weapons again, but didn't do anything that time. This is a dust-coated Gavart's weapon of war. Try the ginseng powder. No. Uh, whatever. Oh, I missed the curio in that room. Fuck. I just told myself to try not to miss those too. Hang on. Hang on. Ow, oh, that's a really unfortunate hunger trigger. Oh well. Yeah, totally missed that. No shovels here. Maybe a key? No, okay. Try it? Alright, yeah. Torch. Nope. Uh, anti-venom. <laughs> Makes sense. Now, God, I used anti-venom. You can't get me with rotten flesh. I was protected. 
it does look quite a bit just like a pile of rocks back there, yeah, for sure. Some of these curios blend into the background a little bit more than others. Okay, give that a go. Cool. Be gentle. For sale or for study, Ow. these artifacts are precious. That hurt. Um, that's gonna be bad. She's in danger. It's actually kind of convenient. It gives me a chance to heal her. I'm gonna have to pass on my buff for a turn, though. Yup! Mm hmm. Uh, let's see. It's a very, very low chance to hit initially. But healing does very little for me right now, but I suppose I might as well just do that. Yay, cool. Bird up! Uh huh. Yeah. And battlefield medicine. Just gotta pass on the buff for a second. No problem. Oh, good. That actually worked out perfect. She got to act before he did. Now we can illuminate. We'll go for the highest hit chance. Might actually give us a hue opportunity, which would be great. More than happy to go for that guy. That's unfortunate, but I'm glad we... Oh, damn. Huh. Okay, now she's definitely in danger. This is still totally an option. Oh, God. Damn. Ooh, boy. Okay. They're starting to hurt a little bit. Let's go for the big fat heal. Oh, perfect. Crit the one with full health. Thank you. I mean, that's... <laughs> At least there's a crit, Bear. Come on. Ah, uh, Hel Hellion's definitely got to move forward there. Ooh, baby! Do not relent. That'll work. Unfortunately, she doesn't have a charge forward or anything like that, but she's definitely got to move back to be able to battlefield medicine that. Do -do -do -do. There we go. Just play it safe. No reason to be risky here. I really want to delay this at least one more uh, round to be able to heal the group again, too. Might self-heal on the leper as well. Ah, uh, never mind. I should probably have him heal. Ah, I can get away with it. I'm fine. I'm good. Just hit him with this. Good stuff. And group heal. Nice. Uh... That's gonna go away, right? Now that I already had to tick this turn, I think. Might as well just heal one more time. Didn't do us a lot of good to go for the uh, attack there, I don't think. Oh boy. Thankfully, it didn't bleed again. Ah, oh, shit. Uh, yeah, you might as well just do that. What a death stroke. Wow, crazy! So impressive. Look at him saw through those dead bodies. What a warrior. hi yeah, Fucking hell. He's very strong. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and dump this in favor of that. We'll use a key. Cool. That'll do. Right, one more hallway, and then, uh... Oh, nice. Mall directory. Cool. Probably go for this empty room. I think go through that battle and then camp out. That seems wise to me. I wouldn't mind just going ahead and burning through most of the torches here, too. I want to try to, uh... Oh, there's a vendor. Cool. And an EB Games in here, too. Yeah, this is... Must be a really old dungeon. Okay. I can group heal again. Hey, Jackson. 
You only fight human enemies in this mod? No, not only humans. Just been running into a lot of humans here. Alright, buddy. I'm ready to go again. It's giving us... Yeah, this is a pretty good effect. Lowering their dodge is nice. Their crit chance is kind of high, too, I think. Hey, that'll do. Probably gonna go for the one shot on this dude, although... Oh, he's being guarded by... The grunt, right? Yeah, shit. Hmm. I could stun the grunt, I guess. Or try to. That's a good idea. Ah, shit. Well... I don't know, I feel like I should try to go for the Hughes still. Yeah, that's probably the better play. There we go, definitely now. Even though that's gonna be, uh... Repost hit on the, on the leper. Oh, he is gonna... Oh, he's, he's just dead already, never mind. I don't need to heal. Although, oh, good lord. Well, a Hellion's dying, what else is new? I just realized, yeah, no, I kinda messed that up. <laughs> Look at the fucking damage. Holy shit, I really wish I could just hit this guy. I guess a Hugh is still a pretty good choice then. Yeah, no, that certainly did the job. Lazars! Welcome back. Thank you very much for your resubscription. Welcome on back in. Appreciate the support. 39 months. Finished the, watched the first half on YouTube. Nice. Glad to hear it. Man. I'm beginning to like the Vestal a lot. Oh, good lord. 4%'s feeling an awful lot more like 40% with this Plague Doctor, man. <laughs> so much for the PB. Wow. That is... That is something. 134. And there we go. Goodbye. Another skirmish, another step forward. Okay, man, shit. Gotta get to 169, right? Yeah, absolutely. Holy hell. I think now we probably... Well, no, I'm pretty okay with just burning all our, all our torches still. Oh, yeah, archaeology kit. I am sure the previous owner would not mind. Uh, you go for that. Don't torch it. Wow! Cool. Okay. Um, here. Do that. Keep the key. Uh, keep the archaeology kit over the anti-venom. And that'll do. That's a good find. And the vendor. You want a key or an archaeology kit? What about a torch? How do you feel about a torch? <laughs> not much, but I'll take it, he says. Yeah. Yeah, it's not a good deal. I should have given him some I should have given him something else there. Oh well. I don't think I want the bloodied fetish. It's not bad actually, it's kinda good, but Yeah, I'll keep that. I'll keep that over the key. Okay, whatever. One more room, and then definitely camp, because I've just been putting out the camp for way too long here. Oh god. We must be more vigilant. Yeah, definitely camp after this one. Our path is revealed. March on. So we go. Ah, no key. Fuck. Secure it and march on. We still have Okay, finally do this. Look out for one another. Companions are Here we go. Path. Sanctuary? Um, let's see. Oh, is the leper religious? No. God damn it. That would be nice. Plague Doctor is. That doesn't really help very much, though. Hmm. Battle Trance is not great. Reflection is okay. I'll go for that. I just encourage a lot here. Reducing stress on the party feels pretty good. Yeah, it's good enough for me. Cool. And off we go. 
We've actually gotten through here fairly well without any shovels, which is very surprising. I feel like that is uh, atypical. You usually get punished quite a bit more for not having any shovels in the inventory. <laughs> yeah, that's a tougher fight. Surprised him though, that's good. Probably just gonna heal though. Okay! A little stress relief. Good stuff. We'll buff it up. Still got that melee damage buff for a little while. Yop him. Okay. How do we handle this? Love seeing that. Love it, love it. Oh, guard each other. Be ideal. Let's go for you. Makes sense. There we go. Definitely gonna hew the frontliners here. I like going for you still. I know the dodge chance is pretty high. I gotta try. I gotta give it a shot at least. Not a problem. I mean, I just want... I gotta try to get a new PB here. Wow, that was... Minimum damage, unfortunately. That sucks. Huh. Just kill this guy. Yes, strike true. That'll do. That opens up a hue option, which ought to work out pretty well. This guy's already quite hurt. That blight stacks nicely, man. That's really good. Oh, that's bad. Okay. Jeez. Those are crazy buffs. There we go. It's better. Goodbye. This blade's quite effective already. We'll just go for that with the finisher. Very nice. And a little healing for fun. Yeah, sure. A lot of this is actually just the original Darkest Dungeon music hug, but they did great job. They did great work on the additional music in this mod as well, for sure. Yeah. But yeah, that was definitely just an original song. <laughs> so props to Stuart Chatwood, but uh, yeah, I think I'm gonna finally get rid of this thing. Although it's definitely worth more than the citrine, actually. Now that I think about it, so maybe not. There we go. It was a very easy dungeon. Oh, look, a shovel. <laughs> cool. I might as well go a little further. I can just camp again. Oh, hi. More loot, yay! We surprised another enemy. Repeal. Our care for one another is what sets us apart. What's the worst that could happen? Exactly. It's not like the Hellion is gonna die or something. Right? That's not gonna happen, right? Right? Mm -hmm. Nothing bad happens in Darkest Dungeon. <laughs> He is buffed up. Holy shit. Okay. Mmm, crit. Okay. That's still pretty good. Ba-boom. Spread it around. Uh, okay. <laughs> Wow, that was pretty sick. He nearly one-shot this dude on a hue. That is insane. Sinister Mr. Cream! 
full year on the pile. Welcome on back in. So you appreciate it. Thank you for the reset. Thank you for the bear hugs. Come on back in. Light him. There we go. He's done. He's done. See ya. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That's the stuff. Goodbye. Oh boy. That's fun. That's a lot of fun. Let's go for that. Okay. Mm -hmm. One more. Ah, that sucks. I was hoping to get a feast at the end. Cool. That was easy. Huddle together. The night. Oh, I'm an idiot. <laughs> Whoops. Fight on empty bellies. Oh well. Definitely gotta do sanctuary still. Um I could rebel actually. Yeah, Rebel's fine here. Gets the Hellion stress down. And then we can do an encourage. Um let the mask down. Oh, I should have done that first, actually. Never mind. Cool. There we go. Alright. Yeah, HP obviously doesn't matter, so. As long as the stress is low, it's totally worth it. Cool. Good stuff. Against the light, our foes will fall. Just eat the food for fun. Yay, we did it. That was a great dungeon. That was really good. I'm going real smooth. Lots of stuff. <laughs> Ooh, that's bad. Oh, cool. All right, I'll take it. I gotta get rid of that damn uh, imposter syndrome, though, right away. Rest deeply here. We must be at our finest to succeed. That is a problem. Put you in there and go like that. And then you get rid of the tapeworm. And you get rid of the hallucinations. There we go. Stress. Everyone's doing okay. Don't really need to worry about that. Already uh, committed to quirk removal. We got one more spot for that. Let's see. That's going to be for... Oh, downer. And I kind of want to get rid of that too, actually. I don't like that. I want you to be a downer, Fluffles. All right. No jester. Oh. <laughs> where is it? Where's the jester, guys? All right, there we go. Only when we cannot sing and laugh is hope truly lost. And another occultist, yeah. The pagan god's power is not to be toyed with by those without proper constitution. It's like I, I like decided I wanted to say that before I even opened the ferry up. <laughs> I'll pick up another musketeer. We can provide her with gunpowder if she can provide us with her talents. I guess I might as well use another antiquarian too, sure. A woman that knows the real treasures of this place will be truly invaluable. Well, goddamn, we're gonna draw another five names. There we go, easy peasy. Pick me in the chat if you'd like to be selected. P I C K M E, all one word. I'm gonna rename these new five members of the squad. Two jesters, a cultist, a musketeer, and an antiquarian. Why are you doing that? Let's figure out what the heck is next. Where are we going? I like a long dungeon here. Ooh, Hunter's Talon. Actually pretty good. I'll take that. Oh, I like that a lot. That's fun. That's a fun trinket. Can't bring the occultist here. I think we'll rock with the uh, level two Vestal. Seems good. I can use a Flagellant here. I don't think I want to use the Hellion again. I 
don't mind a musketeer. And then let's go with... I need a little more damage, I think, in this team. Let's bring out... That yeah, could be a Hellion again. I kind of want to go with a Houndmaster. I'm going to go with Cracked Hoof. Get the Blackjack on there for once. Yeah, this works. I like this. All right. Hatch Eye, welcome on into the team. Congratulations. Our brand new Jester. I suppose I can bring a Jester out, too. Now that I think about it. We should try a Jester, actually, yeah. Give it a go. Bring Hatch Eye into the mix. Horse Deer. Welcome on in. Congratulations. Tercher. 85. Tercher 85. Welcome to the squad. I got Stranger Heart in as our new musketeer. Welcome. And finally, Viv. Viv 3434. Welcome to the team. Rigged. Plain and simple. No other explanation. You got yourself on any skill, buff self. Oh, fun! That's cool. Yeah, give him the lucky dice. I love that. Ooh, damage buff. And then... Let's give him, I guess, Slippery Boots? That's pretty good. I think the NLSS Jester is the most cursed. <laughs> ah! <laughs> I don't like that, yeah. That's upsetting. Mm -mm. Prelude. Oh, right, yeah, the prelude to the finale, of course. I don't know if we're going to be doing a finale jester here. I think this might be a uh, third row slice him up jester. I'm pretty sure that's the play here. Although we've got different skills, of course, with this guy. Hmm. Suppose I could do Dirk Stab. Solo. Finale. Battle Ballad. This is actually not bad. I kind of like this. Keeping him in the third spot with this isn't a bad option. Battle Ballad. I think Battle Ballad, Dirk Stab, or actually Battle Ballad, Dirk Stab, Slash, Solo into Finale is a good way to go. Okay, cool. Probably go unlock some camping skills for these guys, too, in a moment. Houndmaster's good to go. Let me give him the, uh... Let me give him accuracy. And then damage, I guess? He is our primary damage dealer. I want to give you... Added bleed amount applied. And then... I guess... I don't know what else I want for you. More experience? I don't know. Less stress. No, it's less speed, though, too. I hate the speed debuffs. Less stress, sure. Why not? And super fast Vestal, which is always working for us. Cool. Okay. Going in to check now on the skills and weapons for this squad. Boom, boom. Mm hmm How are we doing on... Ooh, close. Very close. We should go for this. Let's swap some of these guys. Let's just do one, I guess. Yeah. 
Oh, I could- I <laughs> I swapped one extra for no reason. That was- that was a dumb move. Oh well. Oh, these guys aren't gonna be able to level up to level 3, though, is the thing, so there's actually no reason to do that right now. But maybe this? Can they get up to rank 3 on uh, level 2? I don't think so, can they? Yeah, it's gotta be re resolved level 3 as well. Okay. The takeoff endure for probably hmm suffer. I kind of like suffer. That's kind of neat. Transfer blight, blight, bleed, horror, and mark to the flagellant. That's a fun move. So let's upgrade those, and might as well upgrade that too. I think transfer horror is new. Yeah. Okay, you are going to use this stuff. You are going to use... Oh, you're already leveled up. Okay. And finally, camping skills. We get the flagellant to get... Yeah, let's get all four of his. Let's actually... Let's upgrade this so that it's less expensive. At least once. It's probably worth it. And then you are going to get... Ooh, nice. Hound's Watch prevents the ambush. Every Rose Has Its Thorn is an extremely good one, along with Tiger's Eye I really like quite a bit. And then he's gonna swap to that from Pep Talk. There we go. Jester actually has some really nice camping skills. And how is the religion on this squad? Not, a, not incredible, but maybe worth doing. Let's do a bless. I like that. Alright, cool. Good stuff. Good stuff. Let's do it. Mission number two today. The long apprentice one into the catacombs. Yeah, faithless vessel is certainly... Certainly interesting, isn't it? This will bring a few laudanum this time. A couple of cleansing salts. Actually bring shovels this time as well. I think I'll just bring two stacks of food. One stack of torches. I'm gonna go no anti-venom or bandages this time. Get a few archaeology kits. I'm gonna get the honing oil because I know that that's usable. Although, actually, it's not as good on my current team. No, I didn't forget about shift clicking. I'm just doing it this way for some reason. Uh, I think we're good. Keys, I guess. Yeah, that'll work. Here we go. Ugh. Bear stretch! Oh, bear stretch! Oh no, I'm stuck back here. I can't move. Oh, it's too comfortable. Quick nap. Quick nap. Nap break. Everybody take a nap. Oh, that's nice. Mm, okay. Okay, that's enough. Ugh. There is much to be gleaned from these age-old workshops. Establish a route through this area. If you close your eyes, you can play any game without paying for it. <laughs> Indeed. Alright, this is an explore, so... No reason to go to every single room. Steadfast Pendant. Reduces cooldown on Barbaric Yacht by one round. That's kind of weird. Hmm. Up we go. It's been kind of common for us to go through the first, like, three or four rooms in a dungeon without seeing a single enemy. Which I wonder if that's by design for the mod, or if that's something they can even change with the mod. 
I certainly don't mind it. Keeping things fairly uneventful and simple for us early on. Alright, here we go. Certainly love a jester for the prep round. You gotta you gotta think that's gonna be a pretty big advantage for us. This is good. Let's see. Not a lot that this guy can do in the first round, unfortunately. I guess a 13% buff to protection is pretty good for the very beginning. You can also just try that. That works. So this guy's bleed resist is pathetic now, so we should probably go for that. Bonk. Ballad number... Oh, wait, no, we can't do another ballad, right? I guess we just do the solo. No, I think I should do Dirk Stab, then solo, then finale. I think that'll be best. Good. Kind of wanted to go for that guy. I probably should have, actually. Oh, he heals. I definitely should have. Whoops. Oh well. I'm excited to see how effective the finale can be. I think we're building it up pretty damn well here. It's already got plus 80%. Let's go for the solo. Oh, we're at finale already, right? Yeah, no, because we can go and. Yeah, we can do finale from second spot too, duh. I didn't think about that. Cool. Okay. Well, I should probably build it up one more turn still. Unless. Oh, yeah, we can just one shot this guy. Cool. That'll work. Go for the stun. Nice. That's pretty big. Probably not gonna stun that guy again, so I might as well just do it. Go for the kill. Big bleed, good stuff. Love it. Keeps lowering his bleed resist too. Actually, at zero now. That's awesome. We're just gonna be bleeding everybody out, man. It is very interesting that you can't just stack battle ballad buffs with the jester anymore. It's a pretty big change. Stat. Blam. 24 bleed. Let's make it a little more. Yep. There you go. Will eat well tonight. Very good. Wars consist of a great many battles. Continue. I'll hang on to that food just in case we run into a hunger trigger before we have to eat it to get rid of that for the inventory slot. I should probably re rearrange my party too. Ah, shit. Oh well. Not a big deal. <laughs> I think we could just group heal. Might as well chance it. <gasps> nice! It's a great start. Hey, good stuff. Make sure that Vestal doesn't take too much unnecessary attention. I need a I need a horn a desk right next to me to be able to do that with that guy. Be a conch shell. Bonk. That's a pretty low on a stun there. There we go. Probably stun that guy though. Nice. Cool. Yeah, sure. 
We don't have a great way of dealing with the champion with this squad. Yo, sick. That's awesome. So we might have to leave him for last. Just gotta hope that he chest caves the flagellant a lot more. Outmaster has a ton to dodge though, so that's good. Ain't gonna stun anybody here. Might as well just go for a judgment, I guess. Debuff action. Spatiation. Go with the Dirk Stab. Seems good. And the kill. Alright. Ooh, a Reign of Sorrows. Is that going to be enough? It might. Wow, hell yeah. Okay. Holy cow, this is just flawless so far. Fuck it. God damn it, come on! Come on! Alright. Ooh, tapestry! I see, we're definitely eating the food now. Give me that. Give me that. Um, in place of that, for sure. And then you can replace that for now, I guess. I never take these citrines, man. I might go for a camp early on here. Make some in, uh, make some more inventory space. It feels like a bit of a waste, though. I am sure the previous owner will not mind. Man. A generous bestow. Jackson! Give him a sub. It's a hatch eye. Welcome into the team. Welcome into the pile, JD. How's it going, dude? Uh fuck. I think I need these more than I need more than I need the money right now. Here we go. Yeah, I still don't want to use the campfire this early on though, although I'm beginning to believe that I should probably just go ahead and use at least one of these early or one of these long campfires early on in the dungeon just to be able to at least get a little bit more space for stuff. Even if it's not really an optimal use of one. Our cause is righteous, but requires funds. Oh, man. Oh, boy. Yeah, already in big trouble with the inventory. I think... Better do it here. One more room. One more room. That's my old... My old motto. You can always go one more. Ah, shit. Hey, Mystic. Best wishes to you. One more room! I can do one more. I can get away with it. I'm not worried. More than our enemies will attempt to impede us. We can do one more room! Oh, wait, no, never mind. This is a combat. All right, now we can probably... This is probably good. Guard dog? I mean, this has been working. Wow. Jesus. Cool. And stun, maybe? That'd be amazing. Wow. Very lucky. That was an extremely good prep round. Keep it up. What does Solo do? Mark self. It's just a big buff. Oh, this is actually... Uh, I don't really want to do that because the Houndmaster is guarding him, so it's not really very helpful. I'll just take the buff damage. Stun. Okay. And I am loving that bleed so much, man. See ya! Holy fuck! Wow. Ah, no dodge. Oh, horror, not too bad. Guard doesn't really matter. So I'm gonna finale you anyway. Do 
good bite. Now I get to bleed him again. Woohoo, nice. Like a rid of the horror, cool. I love that. Oh my god. Look at that. 27 per tick. Holy shit. Devastation. Absolute devastation. Homie's dead for sure, we know that. We're gonna heal the full if we can here. All good. I'll transfer the horror. Take that upon myself. Ooh, cool. Whoa. Weird. Huh. What was this bleed skill chance? I'm kind of... I was excited about it until that very last line. I was like, ah, that sucks. I don't really want to use that. I'll take it. But... Probably not going to use it. Oh well. Definitely gonna camp now and then go for the curio after that. Hi Taffy, bye Taffy. Alone we will die. Together we will rise. Not one more. No, 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 no. We're okay. We're quite alright. Go for a half there. Chubbs is so good. That's my boy. Hello, good morning. Hello, good morning, bud. Oh, you're so good. Hello, Trevor. He's getting butt scratches. Getting them butt scratches, bud. You're so good. Morning. Sin Victor. You caught some chub scratches. Just in time for the chips cam. And Taffy too. Taffy, come here, hello. Hello, puppies. Puppy dogs. Oh, this is this is the moment of respite right here. This is what every camp needs to be. Where can where's the bring chubs to camp option? That probably cost all 12 points. Oh, uh, you wanna show chat your hair? You just gotta show them in that webcam right there. <laughs> Can you lower your head a little more even? There we go. Well, that's that's the perfect angle, yeah. <laughs> it's so cool. It's, it's, uh, well, it's not fiery. It's like a fuchsia. Yeah, that's a good word for it. Mm -hmm. That's a fun color. I like it. Chat says, nice hair. At least you look great. Everyone loves you. <laughs> <laughs> that's pretty close. It's pretty close to real. Yeah. <laughs> Not the color she expected. But I like it. But she likes it. Good to hear. Alright. Cool. That was fun. I should get a matching color. Yeah, that can be like a... Oh, we'll make that a uh, sub goal. Back to a thousand subs, Bear dyes his hair pink. How about that? We're uh, 170 away. So, good luck. Oh, uh, let's see. Probably want to prevent the ambush again. I've got the Jester's one to do that. Oh, no, wait, no, that's the... What did I, oh, it's the Houndmaster, right? Yeah, the Hound's Watch, which is actually a great one. This is a really nice option for preventing the nighttime ambush. Adds to your party's chance to surprise the enemy. Mystic Envoy! Welcome back. Well, that'll certainly get us started. 160, I mean, right. And thank you to Synchron TV as well for the resubscription. On back into the pile. Allied Kale, thank you for the four months as well. Good to have you. Thank you very much for the support. Let's use some of these uh, really nice jester moves here. We can go for the. Oh, actually, I don't really need stress reduction, I guess. Who's the other religious member? Pagan counts as religious, right? I suppose we can find out. Let's give it a try. Apparently not. Okay. Guess not. Yeah. Probably specifically says religious if they're religious, right? Yeah, that's 
That's logical, bear. Okay. I almost want to do Lash's Anger, but 20% damage doesn't seem like enough. Does anyone have a disease? No. Um... I guess just man's best friend. It doesn't really help that much. Kind of wish I had an encourage for the, uh... For the Vestal. Let's just get the disease kit, see if there's maybe something we can use on that. Or use with that. We are. Oh, we can cleansing salt this. Right, actually, hold on a second. Let's use the Vestal on this one. We go boom. Ooh, plastic fruit! Another 10 gifted. Thank you very much for that. Welcome to the pile, everyone. Well, there we go. All of a sudden, 150 away or something like that. Tug, thank you for the bits as well. Is your bits for crits still active? If so, then here's some bits for crits. I believe so. I think you've just queued up a crit, so... Appreciate that. Let's go. Let's go utilize it. Uh. <laughs> Just in time. All right. Battle bell. Yeah, this jester's face is incredible, man. I'm, I'm a big fan. Yeah, this flagellant is hitting every prep round shot too. He's been on fire. Love it. I think I might actually allow the um. Might allow the Jester to be exposed to damage. Just because I know that I can like, go for the solo and get that huge dodge buff and give the middle of the pack a really good chance of dodging the attacks. This mod is fantastic, Cam. I'm a big fan. Big fan of it. Our path is Let's try the solo out. I kind of like this play. Get the focus on him, try to get them to waste their moves. Then we can finale the uh, Terpsichorean, too. Seems good to me. Oh, you just gonna die? That's very close, holy shit. Target him. Oh, Alright, that works. Don't get bear to dye his hair. Nice! He's already dead, too. This is done. Mission accomplished. My mark. Alright. Goodbye. Is cleared from our path. Goodbye. Let's use that. Grab the jade. Call it good. Cool. That was easy. Stone, debris, foliage. None of it will slow us. One more shovel. Oh, vendor, cool. Ah, I wish I had something better for you. How about a salt? Huh. I'm sure it'll come in handy, he says. That's a fine deal. I'm happy with that. I think I go down to the bottom, all the way to the end, and then come back and then go to the middle. That seems like the best idea. With one shovel, though, yeah, it's a little concerning for sure. Dust coated Kvart's weapon of war. Nah, I think we need bandages for that one. The sweats. Oh, fuck. Malfi. That's not good. Welcome. Robin Abra. Another gifted Abracadang Dong. Welcome on to the pile. Thank you very much for that. Appreciate it. Bear hugs. Yeah, definitely gonna have to do a little bit of backtracking here. Well, I don't remember to give that to a ranged person. I actually committed that to memory now, I think. Keep on going. Ah, oh, God. What is this? That's... Oh, yeah. I'm going to go ahead and get rid of that, actually. I don't want to have that weighing us down. Freeze up an inventory slot, too. Very likely that we end up camping coming back the other way here. All right, that works. Still not 100% sure what mystical skills are. I'm sure we'll find out soon enough. Yeah, the voice actor's really good, isn't it? Yeah, the new narrator's really great. I think we're all pretty big fans of him around here. Oh, man. Nice. Ooh, boy. Welcome. YMK! 
YMK606, welcome on in as well. Appreciate your resubs or appreciate your subscription. Get him a few bear hugs, folks. We're a brand new member of the pile. Love to see you. Thank you, thank you. I might as well. The odds are decent. Okay. Okay. I think we got a really good approach with this squad. This is how I've expected the prep rounds to go up to this point. But even without the incredible prep rounds, I'm pretty damn sure this team is going to be doing work. So, now we play with the uh, expectations that we had from the beginning. Although, unfortunately, a little bit of damage has gotten through here. Hype train success. You were definitely the first target. Try to counter that little bit of damage there. Still, I think Reign of Sorrows on these guys, although, again, I probably want to just focus you until you're dead. You are a big issue. So let's get rid of you. An obstacle is removed. I mean, I, if I known I if I known I was just gonna one-shot it, I would have just done that. Oh, no way. <laughs> the redemption arc, man. Hello, Bear. This is actually Cloud 606. The real Cloud 606. You're not yanking my chain. Really enjoy your stuff and apologize for my comment here to show you some love and support. Oh, that's you're going above and beyond, man. I hope you did. I hope you didn't take it too personal. I didn't. I was not hurt by the remark. I I simply saw an opportunity to poke fun and took it. I think we can all come away from that encounter better people, right? I appreciate that. Thanks for the sub. Oh, man, Malfi boy, I'm worried about you, man. That's, uh... I can't just... It doesn't, like, bestow a mark onto him, right? Yeah, there has to be an existing mark for him to transfer. Oh, this isn't good. To the bear That's pretty bad. Simply Vin. Thanks for the prime sub. Welcome on in. Appreciate it. Ken has context. Yeah, I can give you a little context. It's, it's nothing. It's, it's, a, it's a nothing story. Very simply, uh, Cloud 606 comment. It's, it's a very, honestly, it's like, it's not even, not even like a mean comment. It's, it's pretty lighthearted. Said something like, hey, Bear, I think these videos are pretty boring. You might want to move on to the next game. So I responded with something along the lines of, you got it, Cloud 606. And may I say, it's been an honor and a privilege to make every decision on my channel for the last nine years exclusively based on your input. It's kind of funny. Just joking around with the guy, posted it on Twitter, goofing with him. That's the whole background, man. That's, that's literally it. This is the extent of the drama on this channel, man. This is the worst it gets around the bear taffy parts. God, it's just devastating, isn't it? Light, our foes will fall. Yeah, the dra drama channel is going to be <laughs> eaten tonight, man, with this juicy gossip. <laughs> uh, I don't know. I feel like I want the gold over the trinket here. The warrior's bracelet is actually kind of good, though, is the thing. Oh, that's not what that is. That's the arcane armlet. I thought that was the warrior's bracelet. Do I still have the warrior's bracelet? I think I got rid of that. Oh, whoops. I wanted to keep that. Oh, well. Oh, well. Bear Taffy hates his viewers? You heard it here first. I did toss it. Yeah, darn it. Crap, dude. Oh, well. I mean, you want that, don't you? So I'm not, I'm not even going to worry about it. I'm gonna let you bleed out. <laughs> mm, that's a tough fight. That's good. That helps. Okay, let's see. Definitely gotta go for your heal first. Gonna guard dog for sure again, even though obviously that's increasing the likelihood that the uh, 
Houndmaster is targeted, but it does increase his dodge significantly as well, so I think it's probably worthwhile. I guess he could have himself heal, actually. Yeah, no, that was a much better play now that I think about it. I don't know why I wasn't doing that. That was definitely the better idea. If you missed the bear watch, has it gone under? I do miss it, actually. I think I'm probably going to get back to Power Wash Sim. Maybe not before Darkest Dungeon 2, but probably soon enough. Probably before, like, the end of the year. I know we're going to be going pretty, uh, pretty deep into DD2 once it hits. So I don't want to necessarily, uh, suggest that we're going to be getting into too many things in addition to that. That being said, I do remember what I said about wanting to continue multiverse, and I still intend to do that. I haven't really had a lot of, uh, or a ton of energy for any evening streams this week, but I absolutely want to play some more multiverse, uh, before we hang that up for good. Because that still has a lot left to offer, I think. Like, there's a lot of fun left to be had with that. Double gin already, holy shit. This is round three, Chubbs. Round three, and we already got both these guys transforming. It's ridiculous. Don't you consider this to be a ridiculous thing, Chubber Boy? Yes. Yes. Chubber Dog. Yes. <laughs> Big crits. You gonna do some more Alex? I was really enjoying that. Understands a little tiring though. Yes. Pretty unlikely, unfortunately. I'm, I'm honestly kind of surprised. I thought there would be a bigger audience for the VR stuff, but there's really not. It's not just me, too. I've noticed this with a lot of my streamer friends. It's, it's, it's kind of bizarre to me that there's really not a huge... The VR stuff is not a big draw. They're not nearly as big as you, you'd think it would be. Makes you nauseous. Yeah, that's fair. That's reasonable. This makes you motion sick. Yeah, yeah. I mean, if that's if that's all it is, that could very well be enough of a deterrent, I'm sure. Yeah, that, that's perfectly logical. VR is mostly the experience, though. You lose a lot of it when you're just watching. That's a fair point, too, you know? Yeah, now that I think about it that way, the, the, the Half-Life Alex experience is not nearly as cool for you guys, I suppose, as, as it is for me. <laughs> Just really physically being there, you know? It's quite a bit cooler, for sure. I really don't want to get it, get rid of anything here, man. This is already tough. I think I'm going to have to get rid of that jade. I'd rather have a jewelry, for sure. There's our last shovel. That's pretty bad. That's really unfortunate, actually, that that happened right at the end of the hallway. Bad timing. The jewelry is the, uh, it's one of the currencies. So, in the vanilla game, you have the, um... Oh my god, what are the... I have no idea. I can't think of any of the resources from the vanilla game. I thought for sure when I started talking about it, they would populate my mind. It was like, yeah, it's the this, that, and the other thing that you use in the vanilla game in Darkest Dungeon. Alright, Cress, and then... <laughs> even... Even saying that one, I was like, okay, that's probably gonna get it, right? That's gonna get me on the, on the, on the... Right, okay, there it is. Crest, Portraits, Bust, Deeds. There we go, that's the stuff I remember now. So that's... The equivalent to that in this game is Matak, Salvage Jewelry, Amber, and Valor Marks. So that's that stuff. Bye, Chubbs. How's a good Chubber? Man, that thing is landing really consistently in the prep round. That's been super nice. I guess I better use my dog treats. Well, that too-good-to-use syndrome overtake me again here. Kind of forgettable because it's so odd. Yeah, now that I think about it, they are very interesting and unique kind of currencies, aren't they? Alrighty. These two are already basically dead. It's a, it's a massive difference when we're able to land the um, the Reign of Sorrows in the prep round. It's just such huge damage. I mean, this guy's just gonna die to a Dirk Stab plus the bleed. 
That's crazy. And that bleed alone is enough after two turns to kill the Terpsichorean. Of course, we can go for the one shot there, but I'd rather just kill this guy. There we go. This is extremely good. Hey, buddy. He can't make up his mind this morning. What you doing, Chubber? Would you ever go back to Phantom Abyss? I think I'm going to wait for that game to be done. I think I'm going to wait until that game is basically finished. Because I I want to play the version of it that has like all of the levels. I want to play I want to play the version of Phantom Abyss that lets you go like as deep as possible. That's the most exciting version of that game to me for sure. Profane scroll. That's really good. That's really good. That wow. What? Holy hell. Cool. Yeah, go ahead and give that to the Houndmaster, please. Thanks. That is wild, dude. Okay. Um, time to camp to make inventory space and to reduce the Jester's stress. We could probably Look feast. Companions are all we have. Feels like a good idea. Let's go for the Hounds Watch. Uh, we're gonna do turn back time, I guess. Every rose, turn back time. Oh, that's companion. I thought that was him. And then. Oh, I don't have a... Damn it. I thought I had at least an encourage for that. No, no good. I guess I could have done this and then done... other things to reduce... for the squad, but... Oh yeah, disease kit is actually good here, right. For the, uh, flagellant. Or not the flagellant, the... Houndmaster. Yeah, that helps. There we go. Cool. All right, neat. Good stuff. Good stuff. Oh, all right, fine. Last room, might as well. Hopefully it doesn't have a, uh, a blockage along the way. Looking good. Hydration check time. Not a bad idea, actually, yeah. No shovel for that. Click away, I guess. Hmm. Ow! Oh my god! So much for his prep round stuff. Good lord. That's really bad. Alright. Back we go. Why is that called Forgone Coffin when there's only one of them? Where's the other three? Yuck, 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 yuck. Why do they call them apartments if they're all stuck together? Why do you park on the driveway and drive on the parkway? <laughs> I mean, come on. Come on now. What's going on here? What are they called? Coffins? They don't even cough! <laughs> Gee whiz. Oh no. Oh, that's bad. Good lord. This flagellant's in terrible shape now. Why do you bake cookies and cook bacon? This is just, it's getting out of control. Okay, that was a... So I guess there's just random lines that are done by a different narrator? Okay. That's weird. It's cool. Didn't realize that. 
All right, let's see if I can keep getting insanely lucky. Nope. That makes sense. God, okay, use the freaking dog treats this time, Bear. This is a great fight for it. Gonna one-shot the uh, Terps Accordion. That's probably fine. I can actually transfer the mark here, though. But I can also just solo. Then mark myself anyway. Yeah, let's do that. Go for it. And then we'll do boom. Pretty good stun chance. I like Rain of Sorrows here quite a bit. Okay. Actually lands the stress. Come on, one shot. Close to it. Pretty close. I need one more hit, though. Easily group heal to counter that. Ah, oh, man. That's not too bad. Kind of want to build that up one more round, but I feel like that'd be a waste. Might as well just get the guaranteed kill there. Near guaranteed kill. Group heal. Very nice. Reign of Sorrows is okay, but I'd much rather just get the lockdown right there. Stun is actually maybe doable with that, but again, let's just murder things. Why not? Seems pretty effective. Give him a stab. Give him a whack. And then give him a bite on the face. Splendid! Alright, cool. Another step forward. That was good. Now Master did a lot of work that around the dog treat. Certainly made a difference. Yeah, sure. Okay. Very good. Alright, we're gonna be going into the, into the uh, darkness for a little while here. I think we probably roll with, uh, I'd say, one or two rooms of darkness. Ooh, nice! Massively important. Although, unfortunately, that did not scout everything. Oh, there we go. <laughs> that did. Well, most of it. The path is unclear. Rely on each other. New oh boy. Here we go. Any hallway we go into in pitch black darkness is obviously very scary. I think we'll be okay. We still have much to go. We got lots of food still actually in, in the inventory. That feels pretty good. No interactions. All right. Come on. Good, keep it up. Keep it up, buddy. All good, all good. Keep going. Don't you stop. Ooh, nice! Okay! Well, we don't stop there, buddy. We're going for the full cloud. God damn it. We're going for the full clear! Yes, sir! Here we go. Keep it moving, no problem. Hunger trigger, I'm all right with that. And campfire. Togetherness is a rare thing in this place. Sick. All right, so we can get rid of all his. Let's do turn. No, I gotta do a. I don't actually have extremely effective stress relief for him. It turns out. So that works. And then that works, and then that works. All right, good. Use this with basically zero. And... Yeah, good enough. Disease kit. Cool. We did it. Might as well go ahead and treat you. 
before we get home. Probably do the last two rooms. That's a lot better. Alright, here we go. A little inventory space. I might as well go see if I can get some more stuff. Nice. Hmm. I can handle one more fight at least for sure. Definitely. And I have a key for this. Nice. Perfect. And surprised him. Wow. All right. Yeah, we have one, one last dog treat too. I feel silly not using that. That'd be it'd be pretty run of the mill for me. Would be too shocking. Nice. Still landing those hits, baby. Is there a collector in this mod? I haven't seen it yet, but I am uh, assuming there probably is. Just keep raining, raining down sorrows on this back line. Build up a big old finale. Try to stun this guy if we can. Seems like a good idea. Nice. All right, they're basically dead. Just gotta dirk stab this dude. There we go. That's exactly the damage we needed. Good stuff. Let's get it going. This feels like a waste too, dude. I'm gonna save it for the next fight. Fuck it. We'll go through the whole dungeon. Doo -doo -doo. Consider using the bounty hunter? Yeah, we'll probably use a bounty hunter again soon, actually. Since we're going to be getting a good bounty hunter trinket out of this. We'll lower that damage he does here. The bleed might be enough. Oh, no, wait, it's not even close. I'm a silly bear. Thankfully, he didn't actually do anything. Stun again? That'd be pretty remarkable. Quick little bit of damage there, and then kaboom, that ought to do it nice. A little more stress reduction, goddamn, that's crazy. Great loot there, too, hell yeah. Performance for now. Keep it up. Hey, Void Hunter, I'm doing well, how you doing? Shit, man, that was awesome. Here we go, last one. Another surprise attack, damn. That Houndmaster Hound's Watch ability has been playing out, or playing out really well for us here. Very nice benefit. Try to stun again, sure. Why not? Yeah, definitely give him the dog treat for this fight. And one, I'll take it. The bleed. Hmm. I kinda wanna go for this. Holy shit! We killed him in the prep round. That's not supposed to happen. <laughs> <laughs> I guess if I was going to do that, I probably should have gone for the dog tree, right? Yeah, that, whoopsie. Whoopsie, I know. God damn it, I can't. I can't help but forget. It's an inescapable condition of every darkest dungeon run I do. There we go. I don't know why I didn't target that guy. That was kind of stupid. No, oh, well. Just don't deal any stress damage, right? Right? Right, good. Cool. Also, don't kill him. Perfect. Thank you. Finale! Very nice. Not gonna stun you again. Might as well. Basically the same story here. I think I might blackjack. Nah, probably not. No boss yet. No, not quite. Still leveling up characters here. Here we go. See ya. Nice reward. Press on. There is much to do. Good stuff. All right, that'll work. Heck of a dungeon, man. Nice long one. Oh, I did not expect this. Was certainly not ex another surprise attack. Holy shit! 
pure insanity. There's the dodge we expect. Okay, I am gonna do the guard dog here. Wasn't ready for the eagle! Ah! Nope. Sorry, bud. Ah, I wasn't ready for that, but okay. I'll take it. Can do. And stab him. Stab him in the face! Or solo is good. And then boop. Hey, there we go. Big ass crit heal, or crit bleed, I mean. Fine with that. Big money. I think that's gonna kill him. Oh, he's got one HP. Frickin' frick, dude. Ugh. Okay. Pretty much just the one mod, Relner. The Black Relic Burn mod. Along with the NLSS reskin mod. So the two mods, really. Noise. Hey Bear, any tips for someone just getting into Darkest Dungeon? Yeah, are you comfortable with crying? You're gonna want to get real comfortable with shedding tears. Just make sure that's something you're alright with, and then... Beyond that, um... You know, best of luck, I guess, is really all I can say. Stay hydrated for it, right, yeah. Some, some IRL stress reduction is a good idea. If you got some of the, I've got a, I'd grab them if they weren't so far away, but I've got this set of stress balls. You got one of them. You got, you got some stress balls you can squeeze. That might help you out. All right, cool. That'll work. I guess I better open that too. Oh, this is food. I don't know why I didn't dump the food. That was kind of dumb. Oh well. We did it. Sandstones and granite surfaces are becoming almost homely. Huh? Almost, buddy. Almost. All right, cool. Jute tapestry was a giant chunk of our uh, collected treasure that time. Okay. Hmm. Wow! Holy fuck! Yay! That's really, really good. Cool. All right. Treat my ship hands well. You will not find a more skillful crew. Time to treat disease. So I don't think you can actually lock positive perks in. On. Oh, you can. Yeah, I should do that. Get rid of this. Get rid of this. And let's see. We had. I swear we had another. Oh, that's removal? Oh, whoops, hold on. That was um the poet, right? It's locked in by default. That's what I thought it was, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, so don't don't do that. So, oh yeah, very clearly an X next to it. Okay, I see. Whoops. Okay, understood. My bad. Yeah, <laughs> that would have sucked. Um. So then, what the hell? there was another. I could have sworn there was another. Um. Really bad negative quirk I wanted to get rid of. I kind of want to get rid of Catacombs Meanderer on the Bounty Hunter. Yeah, 
let's do that. And then... Ooh, calm and Lazy Eye. Oh, Lazy Eye is terrible on that Grave Robber. I did get rid of Imposter Syndrome. Yeah, I believe the Plague Doctor has finally been freed of that. Let me go pick up... Maybe another Shield Breaker seems okay. I think I've only got the one Shield Breaker, right? Yeah. Another Grave Robber could be good, too. And then a Crusader. Let's do that. The sands welcome those who truly fight in the name of the light. I need to keep some more space for more healers down at the bottom, though. Let's go ahead and draw names, though. And while I'm doing that, I'm going to go ahead and take a quick bathroom break. So do a pick me, if you wouldn't mind. P-I-C-K-M-E in the chat. All one word. We're going to draw two more names. And I will be right back with more Darkest Dungeon Black Reliquary. Let's draw some winners. Who's it gonna be? Who do we got? Our new members of the roster. Mediants. Welcome on in. Our brand new shield breaker. Congratulations. And if you're just joining us, we are currently drawing new members of the roster here. We've got one more slot here if you'd like to do a quick pick me. It's a P-I-C-K-M-E in chat. All one word. No boss fights yet today, no. I'm wondering, actually, I, I, I put out that tweet thinking to myself that there was certainly going to be like a an easy level boss. I don't, know, I don't know if that's the case, actually. That might not be the case here. It's been Bruce. Congratulations, welcome on back into the team. Good to have you. Let me get the capitalization right. There we go. Alright. Thanks for entering, folks. How's the mod so far? Highly, highly recommended. Anyone has uh, given this any consideration whatsoever, I, I strongly encourage you to check it out for yourself, especially because it's so easy to do. You just hit subscribe, and then boom, you're ready to play. It's very good. It's very good. All right, what's next? No easy level boss. Okay, so we are... It's going to be a little while, I suppose. I might have been a little uh, premature in my de declaration of this. Plus 10 dodge when attacked by Levantine. On melee attack hit... Target cannot guard or, or be guarded. Repost attacks when hit. Oh, wow. What a goddamn trinket. 
Oh, okay. We gotta get ready for that, man. I gotta level up our character so we can go take this on. I want this trinket. It's amazing. Well, that's gonna be the case. Do I dare go on a veteran medium? Maybe a short veteran dungeon to begin with. That's probably a good idea. It's pretty scary. I do have two healers. Oh, you know, I've actually got a pretty damn good team. But let's test the waters. This is going to be our very first veteran dungeon here in Black Reliquary, so I think I want to take it easy. Let's go with... Let's go with the, uh... Maybe the Occultist in slot two? The, the rare slot two Occultist? Go with the Stab, the Amber Curse, the Hands from the Abyss. Hmm. Maybe. And the Vestal in the back line, Plague Doctor in spot three. I don't hate it. I don't hate it. Let's get their uh, gear all sorted out, first of all. So these guys being resolve level 3 is going to be big. We're going to try, I think, in fact, we're going to make some swaps here. You can get 10 of this for 15 of those. Boom, level 3 armor and weapons. Love it. But maybe even make another trade just to give us the ability to... Uh, to reduce the cost of gold a little bit here, which feels pretty good to me. Now we're going to start to see the gold go away a lot quicker. This is going to be about where that happens. Thankfully, though, that means that these guys are going to be really well uh, equipped for this dungeon. Level 3 here, too? Not quite. Pretty far away from that, actually. That's unfortunate. Pretty far. Well, we can do these. A little bit of help. And then... Yeah, that'll do. Oof. Yeah, those... Those costs are adding up already. We can always sell some useless trinkets. Should the need arise. Let's go ahead and load these guys up. So we got our new profane scroll here, man. This is amazing. Big dot damage and crit chance addition for the leper. I just give him the extra damage again, too. Pretty happy with that. I mean, crit stone, though. 13% crit chance on this guy? That's pretty ridiculous. Not to mention the extra 5% crit chance on targets above 75% HP. What is that? Like, be up to near 20%? It's insane. I kind of want to do it. I'm going to do it. And then I think actually with the revenge... No, there's no crit buff from that. There is a 9% crit buff from emboldening vapors, though. Though. Which you get them to, like, well above 25%. Man. That's awesome. Alright. Cultist. He's going to be a weird one. I think I might want to buff his damage a little bit, actually. Yeah, speed and dodge is pretty good, too. And... resistances? I am going to have the Plague Doctor with probably... the, uh, Battlefield medicine. Cream Music! Oh, we gotta give you a big shout-out. I gotta assume that's... the, uh, mod team's musical contributor. Thank you very much for your work. We're loving it. This, uh, new Hamlet theme is excellent. Excellent. Very good work. Big fan. Toss a VIP badge your way, buddy. Give the dev team some love. I do like going ahead and adding the Vestal speed again there, and then the Plague Doctor... I don't know, man. I guess I could go for the debuff Plague Doctor again. I don't love it, but I can try it out, see if it goes well. And resistance on the occultist sure sounds good. 
All right, let's not overthink it too much, man. I think we're ready. Oh my god, I nearly just went for the boss. <laughs> Glad I caught that. We even get a campfire for a short dungeon. That's surprising, but there we go. Full stack of food. One shovel might be enough. One might be enough here. I'm gonna go for another uh, salt. Powder's good. One key. And... Two archaeology kits. Good stuff, good stuff. Hey, that's awesome, Kree. I'm looking forward to it. Yeah, let's go. I'm ready. I mean, it is a veteran dungeon. Let's be a little more careful. Maybe bring a couple bandages. No, those are just... I know those are just going to be wasted, man. I just know it. I just know it. Ah, oh, that's a bummer, Vulgar. Sorry to hear it. DOA PC. Hopefully it can get fixed. There is much to be gleaned from these age-old workshops. Establish a route through this area. Here we go. Oh, yucky. Okay, this might be the first truly disgusting map layout we've seen so far. An absolutely disgusting act. Oh, well. Oh, that's pretty good. Torch it up. Sure, why not? Bring us down to zero, man. I don't mind that. I know, right? Yeah, we were just talking about how generous the map layouts have been up to this point. This is, yeah, it's a classic the DD layout, though, right? We are, Sifflet. We're almost through the... the annoying bit, at least. Isn't this a good thing? Nope! <laughs> okay. I gotta keep that little note in mind. Like, that icon to... Oh, you gotta be fucking kidding. God damn it. This land is ancient and fallen into disrepair. I gotta... Like, that... It's not in my brain that that little white uh, arc is a bad thing. It's very much the opposite. And isn't that... In vanilla, it's a good one, isn't it? I swear to God. That symbol in vanilla is a good thing. It's like a, it means like it's stress relief or something like that. Which is probably why that's confusing me. Oh well. That wasn't too bad for the little back and forth to begin with here, I guess. All right, let's do it. It's got to be a ranged character, right? So, yeah, damn it. Disease, the sweats. Not too bad for the Plague Doctor, at least. This is starting to feel like it might just be for some free experience, dude. Wander around with not an enemy in sight. Our foes will fall. Keep going. Is I think that's an archaeology kit too. It's actually nothing. <laughs> okay. Mm-hmm. No wandering bosses yet, or mini bosses, or anything like that. Nothing that I've seen so far. Sure. This has been a very boring dungeon. <laughs> there we go. Some. Some action, man. Doing something here. Let's see. I suppose we just start with the Amber Curse. This is the additional damage taken, so... Doing it on this guy works. And revenge. Careful what you wish for. I, I, wa I was wishing for it, man. I was bored. Give me something to do, shit. Ugh. After playing, it feels like they reduced a lot of the battles. I, I agree. This is a very limited sample size, I think, in my experience so far, but it definitely feels like they lowered the frequency of combat. 
This is our first veteran uh, combat here, too. Important to note. Hey. Cool. Let her rip. There's a lack of minor battles against things like maggots and spiders. I think even beyond that, it feels like there's just a general reduction, too, though. Yeah, I'm kind of with you on that. Maggot and maggots and... Pardon me, geez. Maggots and spiders were never really all that fun to fight. Spiders were always just a pain in the ass. But I think that's, I mean, that's what they were meant to be, right? Very much by design. Pain in the ass. <laughs> Look at those goddamn numbers. Holy fucking shit. <laughs> New PB, everybody. 140 freaking 8. Wow. This leper, dude. Yeah, go ahead and heal him. I'm sure that's gonna help a lot against the leper that's doing 150 damage a hit. I could probably get a stun off here. Gotta keep in mind that his uh, chance at, uh... Well, not a chance at, absolutely is lowering the torchlight every time I do it. I better just go for the chop. <laughs> Fucking Christ, dude. There's the crit chance, too, man. That's what we were building around. I'm so glad it's working. That's so great. Oh, man. F it, dude. That's pretty good odds. There we go. Oh, I was really hoping to get the Q off first. Oh, well. Oh, well. Goodbye. <laughs> God. That's so fun. Ooh, added virtue chance. I like that, too. Off we go. Twiggy, you can't be stopped. Got our campfire for some extra light at the very end here. These hunger triggers have been really unfortunate. Might as well. Okay. Almost certainly go through one more hallway here. <laughs> we shall see who's laughing at the end. Nice. A judgment one of these guys a little bit of expiation works for me thanks for the heal dude oh right yeah that's always I always forget this at the end of that not every time Ebon crown Ebon crown I think thank you for the prime sub I'm going to the pile bear hugs for him. Appreciate it. We're just 141 subscriptions away from bear dyeing his hair hot pink. Hot fuchsia magenta pink. Three colors at once. Uh, Noise. I don't need to heal. I'm good. Actually, I want to do that. Yeah. Ah, same room, Victory. This is my, uh, deceives you into thinking it's a lot more comfortable than it actually is set up. Which I am intending to fix, and in fact, I got a chair, everybody! I finally fucking, finally did it. Just went and goddamn got the dang thing done. New chair on the way. I don't have to break my back doing these streams no more. Hopefully, anyway. I 
me. This is all, it all spawned from, um, that, that fateful magic stream in which the, the left arm of my really nice gamer chair just snapped the frick off. Metal arm just pops right the hell off there. So that kind of set me off into a downward spiral of comfort for a while. Gamer chair. I got a chair that Sin recommended me. I asked, good night. I asked the uh, Discord back channels what they recommended, and uh, Justin hit me with a link to a chair that cost $2,147, so I didn't really want to get that, because that was a lot of money. Although I do understand that's a bit of an investment, you know? It's like, you know, it's for your long-term health you're looking out. I understand the, I understand the justification, but it's a lot of fucking money, dude. It's a lot of fucking money. There's the, uh, well, I got the link for you here too. Still, I can even, like, I can, I can validate the claim. It's the, uh, the steel case. Steel case gesture. That's the one he linked me. It looks good, don't get me wrong. It looks extremely comfortable. But yeah, that's a lot of that's a lot of cheddar, dude. Hear it and march on. We still have much to do. We're basically done. Um Maybe? Maybe? No? Alright. Alright. So I went with, uh, instead of that, I went with another one that nice. Sin recommended. It's actually a Lazy Boy, but not a recliner. They apparently have office chairs, too. So I got an actual office chair Lazy Boy. Which is much cheaper. Which is not $2,000, which was kind of a welcome change there. <laughs> this ought to be fairly easy. I knew it. I knew it. God dang it. Why get a chair when you can just keep using the Lazy Boy? I mean, you'd think so, right? Every time I get on here, everyone's like, Man, you look so comfortable. I wish I was as comfortable as you, Bear. And while I'm streaming, I'm like, yeah, no, I do feel pretty comfortable. And then I get up, and I can't move my body from the position that it was in when I was streaming. It's stuck there when I'm standing. So, like, imagine how I'm formed right now, but my body just stays that way as I'm trying to walk around. I'm just like this hunched over mass. It's pretty awful. So, yeah, don't recommend streaming from a Lazy Boy recliner. It's not conducive to good back health. Oh, good lord. Speaking of which, God, I just... Oh, I gotta move around a little bit. Fuck. Okay. I want to get up after this one here. Case of the old shrimp spine. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Okay, they're starting to hurt a little bit. Starting to deal some damage. Go ahead and get you back. Ooh. No, stop it. Knock it off. Yeah. Oh, that was clearly not ideal. Nor was that. Oh, shit. Um. Well, that was pretty good. Okay. Oh, boy. Oh, no. Should still allow the Hue to get the kill for sure. That's not going to be enough, so I might as well just 
Oh, wait. No, yeah, you need to move back. Ah, god damn it. Hmm. I still hue for sure. That's good. Oh, boy. That's not good at all. Oh, fuck. Our injuries will mount. You must be bound. The longer this thing lives, the worse it feels. I need to go for some risky maneuvers here, I think. God damn it. That's not good. Oh, fuck. Very concerned. Yep, here he goes. Ow! <laughs> Oh, no. That hurts. Okay, gotta try that. There we go, that's better. All right, I guess that's probably what I should have been doing the whole time. Thank you. Appreciate that. It's unfortunate pull forward, but I'll take it. Oh, man. That's what happens with the leopard ineffective for even a round. There we go. That's more that's more like it. Back you go. That's good. That helps a lot. Perfect. Thanks, buddy. Okay. Uh, I guess we're going back one again. Gotta try to get the kill here. There we go. Alright, that blight is enough to kill. Oh, just kidding. It's gone now. I should probably heal. It'll work. Nice! That was huge. Very good. Back to business. Ready to go. All right. A little stress relief at the end there, too. Very good. Back to full. Back to full. Love it. No problem. And then we just do this. Cool. Then we camp at the room. Which is hopefully empty. Nice. Rest. We will need your strength come daybreak. Alrighty. Oh, it's pagan, right? Yeah. Well. He does have the mortality debuff, so that's a big amount of stress relief for him, so that's pretty damn good. I suppose all I care about now is, uh, stress relief, so let's go for it. And there we go. Easy enough. Cool. We follow the ever-guiding light. Not a problem. That did not work. Oh! Well, okay. Um, yeah, we'll go for the Curio, why not? Why not? Oh. Yeah. Yeah, I'm good. See ya. These sandstone and granite surfaces. I'm good. I'm out of here. Nice. Well, that went pretty good. I think that's a uh that's a that's an effective uh toe dipped into the water mission right there. Like, yeah, we can handle that. That's not it's not just going to immediately murder us. We do have a few things to fix up as a result of that one, though. Rest deeply here. We must be at our finest to succeed. Indeed. Thankfully, no stress relief needed either here. Yikes. Really bad. Plague Doctor going to need some work done for a little while. Time to go on another... Uh, novice mission more than likely. 
get another flagellant here for sure. Second Plague Doctor is really good too. Those who embrace struggle and suffering will be at home in the lands below. Let's archive and redo the giveaway here, folks. Pick me in the chat if you'd like to be selected. We'll choose two new names for our new flagellant and plague doctor. Let's take a quick peek on quirks up here as well. Clouded Mind is not that big of a deal. Night Blindness doesn't matter. Tense. Eh. Meh. Catacombs Meanderer kind of sucks. I don't think I need to spend money to get rid of that, though. Thin-Blooded. These aren't that bad. I don't feel... A super strong pull. Coward is actually kind of bad. I'll get rid of Coward. And then anything else? Nothing really stands out. Oh, Imposter Syndrome on Pike Pride. Gotta get rid of that. Gotta get rid of that. Alright. Curry Curie. Welcome to the team. Good to have you. Brand new flagellant. A boom. A boom. And winner number two, Cageman. Congratulations. Welcome to the team. Good stuff. All right. We'll bring some fresh meat out, I think, today. Want a nice long. Exterminate. With some new folks. Get a leper mask. Let's do it. We'll bring out a crusader. A an occultist. We'll go with the occultist plague doctor combo with a crusader and a leper. Yeah. That's pretty good. Doing good, big. How you doing? Oh, Jack Sultan! Gifting a sub to Curry Curry. Welcome on into the pile. Appreciate it. Thank you very much for the support. Let's get our trinkets sorted out. <laughs> I can't... I can't get away from this leper, man. I can't stop myself. He's so good. So good. Throw the profane scroll crit stone on there again, man. Doing the job. Jackson, with another gifted sub as well. Cageman, welcome on into the pile. Appreciate that very much. Thank you for the support. Damage. Speed and dodge, sure, why not? Extra speed for the occultist. And you know what? Let's go with this. Oh, I can't do both. That's right, shit. Let's try this again. I like the debuff. Lowered stun skill chance. We'll rock the debuff kit. Noxious blast and... Maybe even actually... Give her, like, amber blast? Huh. Maybe battlefield medicine, actually, for her, yeah. That'll do. Let's go ahead and, uh... Check their camping skills real fast. See who's gonna need what here. Zealous Vigil's good. Get the nighttime, nighttime ambush prevention. Quarantine is fantastic. I forgot about that option. Let's get that. Do, do, do. Hmm. I like leeches too. Disease kit if we need it. Cool. There we go. Off to the exterminate. Let's provision. Power wash update available now. Nice. Again, I think we'll probably wait for a little while on that game again, but we'll definitely go back to it at some point. More salts. Full stack of shovels. We'll get two stacks of torches for this one. One, maybe two keys. Three archaeology kits. Probably good. Yeah, three campfires for these long dungeons, man. I'll tell you what, I probably am going to force myself 
to use one early on this time as well, just to get the uh, inventory space open and available. Let's do it. Let's go. I finished my coffee off too. Levantine seat to establish mm. out the post here. There we go. Are we simply going to let them? Yeah, food stacks. I think it's four more in this, right? I think vanilla stacks food up to twelve, if I recall correctly. So that's good. That's bad. Be more careful. My bad. Sorry. Maybe that? Aha! Uh -huh. We need archaeology kits for everything. Holy shit. Ooh, this is a fight we haven't had in a minute. Fun. We can go with this to begin with. I think I want to try to kill this guy first. Stop choosing to step on the traps, bear. My bad. My bad, everybody. This whole mod seems big on upping scale, bigger stacks, more damage, more heals. Yeah, they they mentioned that to me at the... Uh... Oh, I just realized he doesn't have his self-heal equipped. I'm going to have to change that. I don't think I looked at the Crusader skills either. i got to change those, too. But yeah, it, it does have a... Uh... I like I like that, though. I think, I think it makes the mod feel even a little bit more unique. The fact that, uh... That's cool. The fact that it's got, you know, that bigger sense of scale to it. Go for artillery here. That seems pretty good. Yeah, I gotta reassign my skills again after this fight for sure. Nah, that sucks. Alright, Leopard, do your thing. Thus it begins... A single blow shall fell the foe. What a death stroke. Stunning blow? Sure. It's a lot of damage for the stunning hit. Uh, probably not gonna kill him with that. <laughs> Never mind. The unquenchable fire of the stars. Oh, right, yeah, I should probably do that. Q's probably going to do it. Q plus Zealous Accusation. Probably pretty effective here. I think that actually did anything, so... Okay. Goodbye. Goodbye. Already full up on inventory. I don't care about a move charm, though. NBD. And we can do this... Good stuff. Hoorah. Okay. Not gonna camp in the very first room. That still seems a little, uh... This land is filled with unseen dangers. A little unnecessary. I think we'll hold off for one more at least. I haven't tried a ton of stuff with this. Let's try the salts. Let's try the anti venom. Okay. Well, now we've actually tried everything with this, so... <laughs> I was wrong. Small map. Very small map. And we'll go ahead and take this. Oh, cool. Okay. If only I had the salt still. Oh, come on, man. Come on, man! I didn't try the camp. I'm not gonna try the camp! I'll try the camp... I've exhausted every other possible option. And even then probably won't do it. I'm not gonna use a freaking campfire for a curio interaction, you absolute lunatic. Hey, pretty good. Do it, coward, you know you won't. I know I won't. I continually try to insist to you that I will not do it. Be 
need more. Oh, I completely... I, I knew I was going to forget to change the skills, too. Even saying it two or three times out loud, I was like, I'm definitely not going to remember. Our path is March on. Hey! Sick. Use campfire or face my ire. Oh, shit. It's a chat chant that rhymes. I'm screwed. How can I possibly combat that? I better do it. No, oh, I have to do it, I know. Camp it out or we will shout. Oh my god, they just keep getting worse. The obstacle is with One down. And I saw L. Thank you for the three months on the pile. Welcome on back in to you. Appreciate your resubscription. Bear hugs if you got them. Thanks for the support. This is bad. Uh-oh. <laughs> I hope the occultist gets to go first. This is not good. There we go. Take a nap or feel like crap. That's, I mean, that's pretty much accurate, yeah. Hey, Falsy, doing very good. Good day today. Draw that bow, buddy. There you go. Amazing. Stunning blow? Wow. That was unexpected. A magnanimous dispensation. I am the salt block. So the shock room users look feminine but sound like a guy. And they do their intro laugh. Are we experiencing a Grudo Link femboy situation? The Illuminati. I don't understand that comment, but thank you for the five dollars. I don't think I can comment on it at all. I truly don't understand what you're saying. Miss, I, I, that's like a corner of the internet. I think that I just am not privy to. We press on. There is much to do. Armor piercing. A renewal. Huh. Ugh. I don't think I want to keep that, actually. Nanaki Red! Thank you for the four months. Welcome back to you as well. Appreciate it. Gotta keep the Valor Marks for sure. Those are very important. We'll keep that over the Anti-Venom and then probably just dump the rest. We're looking at camping out next room. For sure. I think it just means try the campfire, please. That's probably what he's saying, yeah. That seems right. I better heal, I guess. Okay, there we go. I also forgot my freaking skills again, damn it. Thankfully, it's not that bad. They're mostly right. Used... Deza! <laughs> How do I say that? <laughs> Three months on the pile, thank you very much as well. And Wibble Wibbles! The full year! Welcome on back, Wibble. Appreciate you. Bear hugs from one and all. Three subscriptions, thank you very much for the support. Appreciate it. We follow the ever guiding light. We sure do, fella. We sure do. Give him a good old play grenade in the back. Ow! Fuck! Okay. Yep. That sound of that pitchfork is visceral. Alright, alright. I suppose that's not a stun, it's just a debuff, huh? Which is certainly a lot easier to deal with. Stun chance on these guys is pretty damn good. For a good old Chopperino. Honestly, Hugh is definitely the way to go here. Maybe at least the one guy killed. Time to heal it up. Ooh, occultist. Oh, buddy, what's happening? Not looking great. Get to do that at least. I 
could do this, actually. Oh, totally. There we go. That's fun. Maybe I want to keep Purge equipped. He's not really even using the self-healer. I don't think he's going to be needing it all that much. Might want to keep that out. Maybe I don't need to move the skills around after all. Hey, sick. That's fine. I'm going to do this anyway. Here we go. And try to stun you. Actually, that's the same guy, so I suppose I just do that. Or not. Off we go. Good old Blight, man. Alright, that's not quite enough. One more big heal on the Crusader, please and thank you. Please and thank you. I said both! So selfish, game. So very, very selfish. There we go. An agonizing death. Slow and measured. It feels like I just never bring Citrine, man. I'm not gonna start now. Togetherness is a rare thing in this place. Okay. This is good. No ambush. Go for the uh, reflection. Let's go with. I guess disease kit. Sure. Probably just dump that after a minute. Is there any other resource acquisition here? Oh, nice. Our care for one another is cool. what sets us apart. That's pretty dope. All right. Very good. Now we can use a key here. Should I just dump the disease kits right away? Indeed. Keep this and replace that. There we go. Cool. No, I don't think I'm actually going to change the skills. <laughs> After having said all that, and now just using them the way I have been, I think I'm just going to leave them as is. Yeah, I'm just going to keep Purge. I'm good. I'm good. Yeah, the shovel. More than our enemies will attempt to impede us. Mm-hmm. Got a lot of combat this time. I'm pretty into it. Let's begin. I think I want to try to get rid of the pitchfork boys faster. They do some serious damage. I'm really loving our prep round of uh, options for this team. Just a big setup followed up by a devastating first round. Loving it. Bulwark. Not to mention we get a little bit of torchlight out of it too, which is pretty cool. These dudes are just tanky as shit. Need a little bit more damage over time on them. Vario! Four months on the bear pile. Welcome on back to you. Thank you for the bear hugs. Thanks for using Twitch Prime. Ow. Owie. Go ahead and rid ourselves of the bleed there. Yikes. Goodbye. And we get big damage. Big damage. Oof. Stun time? Eh, probably just kill time. That's better. That's more effective. Nice. That's the stuff. They do not want to let Pilgrim Boy die. That sucks. EOT's not going to be very effective on him either. Fuck. Man. So tanky. That's the big ass leper damage. Okay, no bleed, right? Good. I can try this now. Come on. Come on, man. All right, we're doing pretty well. Obviously. 
Jesus. He's just never gonna die. Restoring 24 health around. Holy cow. Thankfully, I don't think he has any kind of like super move. He's charging up. He's gonna keep stabbing us with a pitchfork, but. Certainly difficult to get around that restore. There we go. Um, I guess I do that. Oh, that's a single target move now. I just realized that. I, I've been completely ignoring that. Oh, he was expatiated. Or ex expiated. Whoops. Hey, there we go. Wow, shit. Okay, cool. Yay. Um, I'll get rid of the key now. That's probably okay. Shovel on that. Totally. Sick. Okay, cool. Uh, off we go. Jeez, we got a lot of combat this time. I'm here for it. No healer this time. We got three errants. Jesus. Okay. Maybe I can get some light going on these guys. Nice. This is just going to take a while. Right, this is it's making up for the previous few, I guess, of me thinking that there might be a chance at us getting through without a single bout of combat. Yeah, it's all been the clerics so far, huh? I don't think there's been a single other uh, encounter up to this point. Yeah, this missile artillery isn't really doing it here. The play grenade's pretty good. Obviously, the leper's still doing his thing. I think we probably want to go for the stuns more often here. And this dude's the target. Oh, actually, no, I think I want to go for the frontliner here. Yeah, we're going to chop the frontline boy. Crit would have done it, but. Oh well. Not getting super lucky with the crits this time, unfortunately. Later around, keyboarder. Go. Here we go. He's starting to hurt a bit. Is that debuff? Oh man, yeah, that's unfortunate. Pretty strong. Expiates the target. That's what that does now. Okay, that's interesting. I probably won't actually use Zealous Accusation then. I might swap that. Might be our move swap target. I didn't realize he was guarding him. That was kind of dumb. Well, alright. Oh my god. What does Expiate do? It has. Uh, I guess I'll just do it to show you. That might be the easiest way. Oh my god. Backliner's dead now. Definitely. Blight is enough to kill this guy, too. That sucks. Oof. Crusader. Oh. Thank you. That's good. And the Hue. So this is what XP8 does. Oh, never mind. He's dead. <laughs> Think about that. Oh my god, come on. Look at that. There we go. Wars consist of a great many battles. Continue. Let's eat this food. There we go. Stun skill chance is decent, but I don't think I want to have the. I don't want to give up inventory space for it. Let's do this. Cool. Oh, that's the Warrior's Bracer again. Fuck, I should have grabbed that. I probably gotta burn through these torches a little faster now. 
There's our last archaeology kit. Cool, that works. I'm gonna ignore that room. I don't want to backtrack again. Okay. Ouch. Hi, step lightly. I'm trying. Jeez. <laughs> Making it hard. It's a hard dungeon, man. Oh god. All right, frontliner first. Oh, I forgot to swap Zealous again. <laughs> Just the, the whole fucking dungeon that's gonna be the theme. I'll swap it at the very end, right before we leave. Might as well. Cool. There we go. Nice. Oh, no blight. Bummer. Not a problem. That'll start us off. Nice. Ah, shit. Well, didn't get the strongest beginning there. Wow. That helps. There we go. Really need that blight to land. That's just so much damage. Yikes. Okay, definitely gotta get rid of that too. Oh my god, already? That was so fast! What the fuck? Okay. Good lord. Hopefully I can heal first. Hey, good stuff. Please let the Plague Doctor go. Yay, that's huge. Big help there. Thank you very much. No need for that bandage. Time to camp. Kinda early for Alone, it. We will die. Together we will rise. Hopefully the food triggers are kind to us. Prevent the ambush. Let's go with uh, reflection again. With the disease kits. And then. That's probably good. Okay. And then, yes, I remembered. I did. I remembered. Battle heal. Yeah. Or maybe inspiring cry. Let's do Holy Lance, maybe? Just in case he gets put to the back. Yeah, that's a good idea. That's a good idea. Okay, cool. That'll work. That's not necessary, Robin. You must keep eyes peeled. <laughs> I always want to do it. <laughs> Whenever they show me that symbol, I'm like, yeah, it's a good thing. More torches, holy shit. Well, can't keep that. That's a lot of money to, to dump off here, though. I just use these disease kits. Keep that. I guess I better keep this over the bandages, huh? It's probably better. God, these torches have been lasting a while this time. Quite unusual. I don't think the Amber Curse is really helping that much. I'd rather just heal. Keep on emboldening. Yep. We're good. I need to heal. 
Probably should have done some stress relief on the occultist with that camp. Wasn't really paying attention to that, unfortunately. I could probably get away with an abyssal artillery here. That feels pretty good. It's not a ton of damage, but I think it's. Oh, I was gonna say with the, with the light, it might be a significant amount enough to give us turn two uh, turn two kill on those guys. Not a help. Nice. Might be able to chop this guy with a one shot. Or one shot this guy with a chop. I mean. We need the sub goal on screen. I gotta see you with pink hair. <laughs> I mean, if Apollo has uh, set the precedent here, I better go ahead and try to follow in his footsteps, shouldn't I? If it wasn't already like nearly stream end time for me, I would probably commit to it. But alas, I'll be out of here in a bit. Be on either last or second to last dungeon here. I'm thinking we might go for a multiverse run later today, though. Give myself a little lunch break, come back, play some multiverse later tonight. Sounds like fun. Yes. Strike, true. Strike true! Very good. Um, give it a try. Alright. Oof. Yeah, I kind of expected that. No anti-venom anymore either. I gotta get rid of that. That's a lot of damage. That's pretty bad. Especially if he's bleeding too. Okay, it's not as bad. Manageable. This might work. Oh, jeez. That's better. That's more effective. Oh, come on now. What was the hit chance there? It's not too bad. Debuff, too. Usually a lot happier when they decide to do that kind of attack. A lot less scary. Well, that's kind of scary, though. Fuck, the leper's actually really weak now. That's not good at all. That doesn't help. I'm with you for sure, Bill. Yeah, the, the art in this mod is pretty fantastic. Very impressed. Just miss. I said miss. He's not a good listener. Oh, he 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 thought I meant me. He thought I meant me. All right, he just misunderstood what I said. Oh, no, he was just delayed in the response. That's all it was. You are resilient, bucko. There we go. Where was that? Cool. An adequate performance for now. Oh, man. Um, I doubt this is going to be anything good. I'm going to try a torch on there. Oh! You burn the enemy maps. Cool. That's neat. Okay. That does not work there. This might work. Probably not. Yeah, shit. Sweats is really bad on the leper. A lot less HP now. It sucks. God damn, occultist. Come on, buddy. You gotta step this up a touch here, friend. Starting to struggle. It's been all clerics in this dungeon, man. All tanky boys all day. I wish they focused the Crusader a little more with that mark. Just keep guarding. Circle guard. Doo, doo, doo. We fought a couple wolves. Oh, that's right. Yeah, we did just fight the, fight the djinn, didn't we? That's a very good point. Not all clerics, I guess. Oops, all clerics. There's 
There's that, finally. Stun here for sure. No stun. Big damage. I need another occultist heal on you. This ought to do pretty well. There we are. Ooh, the crit restore. Jesus. Hmm. Oh, that's bad. Oh, no. Fucking hell. One down, at least. That's very good. Whoa! Big money! Yay, occultist! That helps a lot. I like going for the stunts here, still. Good. I don't think so, JPC. We're just taking a long time to get through the catacombs here. It might be, though. Now that I think about it, the other areas might still be locked. Okay. Slowly but surely getting there. Bleed is really not that bad. I think I can go ahead and let that uh, play out. 16 per tick. Holy cow. Nice. So he's already dead, so hopefully we get one more healing opportunity here. Purge. Up front with you. Here we go. Finally. Finally a good one. Another skirmish, another step forward. Definitely keep the key over the laudanum there. A cultist is in bad shape. Kind of worried about that. That sucks. I was really hoping to avoid one of those. Man. Shit. One more torch to clear out a spot there. I do have another shovel, right? Yeah, we're good with that. This land is ancient and fallen into disrepair. We even got one more beyond that shovel. Oh, hey. How's it going? Um, I guess I'll give you a torch. I can only give you a key. Huh. huh. Yeah, that'll do. That's a deal. <laughs> there we go. There's a little mix-up. A little variety in there. Go for you first. Embolden the leper. Very good. Still more stuns here for sure. These guys ought to be a little bit more vulnerable to the stun from the Crusader. Should still bulwark though. Always good idea to bulwark. Or torchlight too. Uh huh. Good. good. Love it. Yeah, this ought to be pretty easy. Try to keep everybody topped off as best I can here. Good dodge. I was expecting that, yep. Yeah. That's not that big of a deal. I haven't done any damage yet, really. Come on, one shot. Oh, baby, there we go. Good old leper strats. Stun to boot. Let's go. Nice indeed. I could go for another top off. I wish I knew Synchron. I wish I knew when Darkest Dungeon 2 was coming. I believe it's fairly soon. They said quarter three of 2021, so... That's running out quickly. Very quickly approaching Q4. Not a problem. Stun on you. 
Beautiful. Goodbye. Eh, yeah, sure. Our injuries will mount. We must rebound. No, this has been a good time, Synchron. Yeah, I've been very happy to get back into this. It's been a lot of fun. Glad people are enjoying it. I mean, I guess I might as well. Uh, a better option there, unfortunately. Need another big heal here for sure, though. That'll certainly work. Thank you. Nice. Might as well heal up a little more. Right before the chalk. Bear Taffy's streams are so entertaining. I forgot a pot of water on the stove, and now the water is completely evaporated. <laughs> That's a back of the box quote from me, man. That's wonderful. <laughs> Jeez, okay. No, I, I get it. You can have combat in the dungeons. I understand now. I was mistaken before. Take it easy. Holy fuck. Double bird. Double bird up. Fine, I was gonna do it to myself. So if it's a double bird up, does it go bird up? Is that that's still that's close, I think. <laughs> Uh, yeah, and then do that, right? That's pretty good. Pretty goddamn good. It is indeed, yeah, Cortigos. Exclamation point BR will point you to the Steam community page for it. Stun! Mm-hmm. Oh, you're hurting again. Ow. When did that happen, buddy? Let's get you fixed up. Get you situated. There we go. Oh, it's a big bleed, though. Let's get rid of that, too. All right. Probably when his chest was caved in. Yeah, that probably contributed to it a little bit. I imagine. I'm glad to hear it, Shadow. Big hits. Big hits. Oh, this is an NLSS skin. It's a Sinvicta skin, I believe. It will be streaming Monday, yeah, I believe so. Ugh. Um, I want all that. Definitely want all that. I don't think I can get rid of the shovel already, though. That's a bad idea. Torches? I think it's torches, man. I think it's torches. Alright. Oh, shit. Shit. Shit, 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 shit. Yet again, the citrine is disposed. Yep. Oh, come on! Fuck! <laughs> God damn it. Well, better go for another room, I guess. Thing is, I can't actually, I gotta go, I gotta camp after I get a potential hunger trigger here. But if I get a hunger trigger, I better not camp then. I am sure the previous owner would not mind. Well, here it is. Oh, never mind. We must be more vigilant. The Plague Doctor's in really bad shape. Holy shit. Okay, um... I better just camp. No, we can... We can do one more. Oh, 
Nice. There we go. Alright. Oh, Jesus. What a... Skillful dodge. Right. Okay. Here we go. The dark and the cold are upon us. Keep each other safe by the fire. So... Sell a speech. Um, abandon hope. I should have done that first, actually. That was, yeah, I misplayed that. But that's okay. Hobby. That's fun. I like that. All right, good. Oh, they added stress at the end, bummer. All right, I'll take it. I will take it. And we will wrap up with that. Not bad. Not bad at all. Pretty damn good day in the dungeons, man. Look, look at that. 36 Valor Marks. Holy hell. Pretty good. Folks up to level 2 here. Looking good, man. Looking good. No boss fight today. No, I was uh, I was mistaken in that declaration. And the ballast pours out. We press on. That's going to have to wait a little a little longer, it looks like. Let's go ahead and commit a couple of folks to some disease removal and whatnot here, too, though. I'll take care of that. Do I need stress relief? Not really. Searcher could use it, but I don't think it's necessary to spend the money on that. And we got a couple of negative quirks I think I want to get rid of, too. Tucker Doubt's not that bad. Inaccurate's terrible. There we go. Mm. Calm? No. Anemic is pretty bad. Shocker's pretty bad, too. We could get rid of that stuff. Where'd the other leopard go? There he is. No, that's the first one. Oh, he's committed already. That's what's going on. I see. I see. Well, not much else I think I need to get rid of. All right, we'll go ahead and call that good. Maybe get rid of Catacombs Meander. Yeah, fuck it. There. All right, great. That'll do. Thanks for watching, folks. A wonderful day in Black Reliquary. I had a blast. I hope you did, too. Thank you very, very much for all the support today. Tons of gifted subs and all that. I really appreciate it a lot. Hope you had fun. I certainly did. YouTube.com slash Bear Taffy. You can catch the VOD for these uh, going up over there. In fact, part two is being posted right now.